So one of the things that sort of does bother me a little bit is I'm dealing with a lot of different cities and I'm not getting that anymore. Again, if you notice, I'm dealing with uh, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Well, you know, I, I'm programming. I, I want to make this easier on myself. So I would love it if there was some way for me to use sort of my, my values. And that's actually where this term called enumeration comes from in the sense that now what I'm going to do is I'm going to create variables that represent my numbers. That way I can now make reference to them. So in my case, for example, I would create what I would say to be final int Chicago equals zero. Now why final int Chicago? or why final? Well, I don't want this to change. This is always going to be Chicago. This is always going to be zero. This is always going to be one, two, three, four, five, six. So I, I want a variable that's going to just be easy for me to work with. Again, I would probably do the exact same thing. Probably I would uh, do the exact same thing for Boston equals one. And just for good measure, final int New York. Uh, that's my terrible country accent coming out to try to sound like a, a New Yorker. Uh, I apologize for anyone from New York. The South will rise again. Uh, but okay, I've got now these variables, these constants, these constants, remember they don't change constants. Now what I can do is now to reference them. Again, I named this uh, distance. So what I can come in here and do now is I can say distance Chicago to New York. And since Chicago is zero, it gets interpreted out as a zero. New York gets interpreted out as a two. This becomes zero, this becomes two. And if I look at that, I'm dealing with my zero row, column two, seven, eighty-seven. So it's just a way for me to uh, store my numbers represent uh, represent the uh, elements inside of my array without dealing with the numbers.